Hmm. And who are you working for? Girls, I'm Flying Teacup, and here's a theory I was asked to do on my latest stream. Who is Marvin's lost owner? Who is Marvin? Marvin is a commander for the faction Marvin's Finest Hour, which was added in a glitch in the Frontier DLC. Marvin is an acronym for Mobile Robotic Versatile Entity Automated Assistant, and they're often seen repairing machines across some maps. He cannot speak, but communicates through subtitles instead of words. He was ordered by his owner to help pilots get out of dropship in the beginning of matches. Kind of what he's doing now in Marvin's Fight Sour. But what happened to his owner? It says in the faction description that he was given these instructions a couple of hundred days ago. Something important to remember is that these numbers are not set to a specific amount. They are ticking up for each day that goes by in real life. If you count backwards, the day that he was given these orders was on March 19th, 2014. But some says that it's also March 20th of 2014. It seems to not count with time zones for some reason. So sadly the date doesn't help us a whole lot. But something that does is Titanfall's official Twitter. On the 1st of April, the official Titanfall Twitter changed its profile and went full Marvin on accounts, constantly asking if anyone knew his owner. And this was way before Marvin's finest hour was even revealed. During the 1st of April, Marvin gave us some very important details about his owner, like this tweet. I enjoyed the humor of this program, you are all funny, but have anyone seen my owner? He's 5 feet and 8 inches, and smells like bad choices, or so he says. But he doesn't stop there, Marvin also asked if anybody knows an establishment that sells moonshine, and that the last time he saw his owner was at the tavern next to the East Lexington Iron Works facility on Harmony. Now we know that Harmony is a militia claim planet, so he must be militia personnel, right? I mean, in war games we can see him tuck you in in a sim pod in the intro, and give you the classic thumbs up. The room you two are in is probably owned by the militia because all the other militia faction interests are in the same place. And also you can see the militia colored ogre in the background. So what can we get out of this? It's a man, he smells, he's 5 feet 8 inches tall, he's from the militia, and he was looking for some moonshine. Doesn't that sound a lot like Barker? I mean, just read what he was told by Marvin's owner. It sounds awfully a lot like something Barker would say. And yes, I would totally agree that it's him. If there wasn't for the length of Marvin's owner. What's that supposed to mean? Well, Barker is not 5 feet 8 inches tall, or 172.72 centimeters tall. Is actually 6 feet 3 inches tall, or 190.5 centimeters tall. And even though it was a few years ago Marvin last saw his owner, it's not likely that he's grown 5 inches or 18 centimeters over 2 years. Not at his age, at least. Also, the wanted signs in the Angel City, both in the first and second game, says that he's 6 feet 3 inches tall. Something tells me that this was not a mistake, but that this was made with a character in mind. As Respawn answered in the latest AMA, they are very careful when adding something new in the Titanfall universe. Also, in war games, you can see Marvin standing behind all militia faction leaders while they are trying to help a new pilot or grunt testing an Ion Titan. I mean, if Barker really was Marvin's owner, shouldn't he only stand behind Barker when you're playing as Aces and not the other leaders? It would be a small, very interesting detail, but that's not the case right now. So, who is Marvin's owner if not Barker? This is actually something very weird and complicated. But the only candidate that I could find that is 5 feet and 8 inches tall exactly, male and from the militia, is Jack Cooper. But do I think Cooper really is Marvin's owner? Actually, I don't. It doesn't add up with the background story of Marvin's owner. Cooper was a rifleman, and it seems quite strange that he would get a personal Marvin unit at that rank as a rifleman. So who is Marvin's owner? I still don't know. Maybe it's a character that hasn't been added yet. What if Marvin's owner is just a militia pilot who just ran out of moonshine and forgot about Marvin? In the first game, if you play as a militia, you will be greeted by a Marvin that helps you out of the dropshift. Could this be the same Marvin? 
Could this Marn have taken the place of its owner and then got lost? It's a possibility. Something we do know is that he's still searching for him and trying to make him proud. But before we ended there, a small detail that was pointed out by a user called Alteran Longbow on my bounty hunt theory is that Marvin has a slight possibility to say when a wave of bounty titans drops in in bounty hunt. Bounty incoming, take it out and take its black box. So could this mean that the bounty hunt theory is true? But more importantly, do the remnant fleet know where Marvin's owner is? That is a question to remain silent. So what do you think? Has Marvin's owner been shown before? And is it Jack Cooper? Tell me in the comments, and if you have a theory yourself, then tell me as well. And with that said, thanks for watching and take care.